we can differentiate this expression to check to see that we have we end up with the original. So when I differentiate this, I'm going to differentiate the log part first. So I get 1 over x plus 1 times x squared minus 1 plus log of x plus 1. And then the derivative of that is going to be 2x. And then minus 2x plus 2 plus 0. And that's all going to be, oops, that's going to be the times 2 here. Okay, and then the minus 2x plus 2. And that's going to be all over 4. So looking at the numerator here of the x squared plus 1, that cancels with the x plus 1 of the denominator. So I end up with x minus 1 plus 2x uh, log of x plus 1, and then minus 2x plus 2, and that's all over 4, and we can see that we have some terms cancel out, the 2 times this, these cancel out with these terms here, and then the 2 times 2 here, we end up with 4x log x plus 1, all divided by 4, the 4s cancel out, and we end up back where we started, x log of x plus 1. Okay, so that gives us our original derivative, so this must be the correct integral.